Alright there, I'm James Kyber. Welcome back to another Yu-Gi-Oh! figurine news. Once again, I was on my favourite toy store website. I came across these awesome looking Yu-Gi-Oh! figures. So if we scroll down a little bit, we've got these Yu-Gi-Oh! collectible minifigures. Which is kind of like the micro figures, but these look a bit cooler. Action figures of Yu-Gi, Joey and Kaiba. It doesn't stop there, guys. Action figures of Exodia, Blue Eyes White Dragon, Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon, Wind Dragon of Ra. Sly for the Sky Dragon and Obelisk the Tormentor. You'd think that's it, wouldn't you? But no, if you keep scrolling, there's plushes as well. Of Blue Eyes White Dragon, Wind Dragon of Ra, and Red Eyes Black Dragon. How cool is that? We're going to check each and every one of these out, and hopefully we can try and figure out when these are going to come out. So let's crack on. Up well, first is the Yu-Gi-Oh! Collectible Mini Figures Assortment. So these are like the micro figures, which they're in a random pack. We get a closer look. We got Dark Magician, Exodia, Yugi, Blue Eyes, he looks awesome. I think it's Sanky the Dark Clown, Summon Skull, Kaiba, Red Eyes, P Dragon. What, what is he doing with his arms? Joey, and Jinzo. And he stand on a coin. So there's 10 in this set. So if we look here, we can see the mini packet. It's random and it says here's who is one, but if we scroll down. There's a bit more information about these. 5.7 centimeters. Each minifigure is highly detailed, comes with a Millennium Puzzle stamp base. Collect the 10 minifigures and 4 chase variants, each sold separately. So that's awesome. I don't know who the 4 special ones are, don't, doesn't really show them. Up next are the human characters figurines. They don't look amazing as the Japanese ones, but at the price they are at, they are pretty good. Because if we look here, you can see it comes with changeable hands and the dual just comes on and off so that's awesome so you'll be able to uh, position them in the uh, dual poses and it says includes figurine accessories and exclusive card so that's interesting so these guys are 12.7 centimeters and we're going to check out the other two now where's joey which is cool because we don't usually get a joey but he comes with hands he's already got the card in his hand there's the card behind him the back of the card and there's his dual disc and lastly we've got Kaiba which who has a card in his hand as well didn't notice that he comes with pretty much the same stuff hands are a little different that's awesome that's the human characters you may have noticed the date I'll talk about that at the end now we have the monster figurines up first is Exodia you can see that you can move them out you'll be able to bend these and Pose them, hope. And there he is, he's in an open display box. That's awesome. Shame it's the same monsters, but what can you do? So these monsters are 12.8 centimeters in height, and there's six to collect in this set. So we've got Exodia, Blue Eyes. It looks interesting, I like the coloring on them. Look at the feet. Oh wow, that does look awesome. Pick up the metallic they're using. All right, we got Blue Eyes Ultimate. It's going to be a good one though. These guys come with an exclusive training card inside. So that's interesting. Will it be the actual card? Or one they've made themselves? Here we have Wind Dragon Vra. He looks a little skinny. That one's okay, not amazing. Sly for the Sky Dragon, that looks awesome. Here's from the side. You can just see his feces at the bottom there. And there he is in his box. And lastly is Opalus the Tormentor. From the side, and he looks cool too. Up next are the plushies. We've got Blue Eyes White Dragon, which looks a little bit like Blue Eyes Toon Dragon. Can we get? Oh, we've only got two pictures for this guy. Check how tall they are. 17.8 centimeters in height. And this is from a set of three. So if we got Wind Dragon Pro, which is random. Guess he wanted to keep it all dragon themed. But I really like this. It's not too complex, it's kind of cute. Small and cute. And lastly, we got Red Eyes B Dragon, which is just cute. Cuteness overload there. And that. Pretty much it, that's all, all the new stuff that's popped up recently. This is on a UK website called Smith's Toy Store. I have no idea if they're coming out anywhere else. 
But if it's anything like the micro figures, it's probably just going to be the UK and Europe. And last time with the micro figures, I made a video on the 5th of August. I was able to do another video on the 13th of August. I'm guessing these might be out in the next few weeks. You'll probably be able to find these in geeky shops and geeky websites. These have just only gone up on this website on the 20th of October. Stick around, I'll be opening these on my channel. And we'll take a look at each and every one of them. So thank you for watching, tune in again for more Yu-Gi-Oh! news, and I'll catch you in the next video. Ciao, ciao.